hugely popular. Yeah. And uh, almost every JoJo game prior to All Star Battle is part three only. Yeah. Anyway, go on. Uh, the thing is, Zidane, I think that's the point. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's, that's pretty much... That's pretty accurate. All you need to know is Dio's an asshole. <laughs> yep. And, like, one of the first things he does in that series is kick a dog. Yes, he's definitely an asshole. Well, did he even need to kick the dog? No, he's just being an asshole. I'm saying to establish his, uh... You know, ass... To, to establish that he's an asshole... Um, it wouldn't have happened as fast, I guess, but that's about it. Yeah, but Dio already has a punchable face. <laughs> True. Actually, uh, speaking of JoJo uh, references and jokes, uh, do you watch 50% uh, Off, uh, which is Octopimp's abridged series of Free? I have not seen that yet, no. It's fucking hilarious. Although I did watch the first season of Free when it actually came out. It was actually not that bad. Didn't watch the second season and kind of heard that it kind of wasn't as interesting. Because that's what happens when you bring a series back that uh, ended on a pretty good note. Yeah. Why did I get fucking Onyx? I don't know, except for the game is just messing with you at this point. Thing is, what can I hit this bastard with that I won't, like, knock it into the third Tuesday of next week? Not just the second... Not just the second Tuesday. <laughs> I've got Super Fang. So you say, do you have any physical attacks that it doesn't resist? Because it has pretty good physical defense. So far, we've seen that this guy has Poison Sting and Taunt. <laughs> wow, he sucks! <laughs> like, I know Onyx isn't usually gonna be good, but that's beyond the pale. Yeah. And he caught Rockington. Yep. I think I might call him Rockington. That works. Uh, 50% uh, off. It's actually kind of funny. Uh, I just hope you like a lot of homoerotic jokes, because that's kind of the entire thing. Also, also uh, Haru has uh, multiple personalities. And they all, like, talk to each other. And at one point, uh, there was a scuffle. And one of the Harus shot the only Haru that could read. <laughs> well, I mean, it's not like homoeroticism is the entire point of that series. It's not, but a lot of the jokes in that series. Leans on it, right? Yeah. Leans on it. It fucking lays there. <laughs> <laughs> Like the whole thing with Nagisa? Oh my god. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> <laughs> and the funniest thing is, they gave him the blackest voice ever. <laughs> oh, Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> now, I still haven't heard. Like I said, I haven't watched that yet. The one thing that I remember uh, Octopimp from was the, the Brutal Moose Sonic Boom lightning yeah. round. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking voice of Sonic. <laughs> Uh, just going for the surreal humor there. Yeah. <laughs> Who could I have gotten instead? Motherfucking Hariyama! Damn. Uh, you want me to type, to type the name of the series in a chat? I started typing 40% off. Great. 40% off. I could do numbers, guys. Um, Could've fooled me. <laughs> Ch 
Toy Specs? Why would I want that? In case you really hate yourself. I don't know, maybe if I got Choice Band, but... Yeah. I still say that, um... Deep Sea Tooth would do more for me. Hi, Dodo! Yeah, Tooth would definitely do more for you. Yeah, but given the size of the item pool, the odds of me actually pulling something like that is slim to none. <laughs> yeah, have fun not getting that. Well, I could always just use, uh, you know, Pokegen. <laughs> but where's the fun in that? Yeah. Oh, bet that was fun. Sp fun spelled with a fuck you game. <laughs> <laughs> fuck you game. Drowsy, you're already scary enough. Stop trying to make my golem shit itself. <laughs> Try reaching level 200. So basically, if Golden shits itself, is that a uh, rocks fall, everyone dies type of scenario? Uh, I'd rather not find out. Yeah, that would probably be. Okay, where yeah. is this Machop getting eggs for Egg Bomb? You don't want to know. Uh, why do I get the feeling there's like a how to basic going on here? <laughs> <laughs> What? What is it with me tonight and, like, plugging everything that's, like, a million times bigger than I am? <laughs> you could plug anything and it would probably be bigger than that. You shut up! <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, I, I can't help it. Yes, I can. Uh, the fact that I said level 200 should, uh, say, yep, I got the DLC. He's also got a... Connor's got a copy of my freaking Ares armor set that I was using. Because I backed up my save file and sent him a shit ton of items for him to back up his save and send back to me for my other file. <laughs> oh, a double battle. What could I have gotten? Snubble and Ant-Man. <laughs> Ant-Man. Probably yeah, the worst not superhero. Well, actually, I don't know about that. <laughs> Lax incense. I don't do. I don't do a whole lot of stuff on multiplayer, so I probably won't add anyone else. Litwick. I actually probably would have rather had Litwick. Well, that's something with special attack. Abilities. <laughs> Can I please get more than one step through this fucking grass? No. Well, he wouldn't have been able to play with me if he didn't have the DLC. Because of uh, shuffled around item IDs and everything. Another rare bone. That's 50 bucks. <laughs> nice. Fuck off, Hariyama. Heal bell? Damn it! Thank you. Uh. Yeah, let's see what my not skull it is. Shut up, Dudley. Ass, I don't care. Cross job. Motherfucking cross job. 
Nice. Shaman only has five fucking PP. It's a great move, though. Oh, yeah. Can anyone make use of that? No. Wait, that's... DM2? DM2 is Dragon Claw, isn't it? Or am I reading that wrong? Uh, TM numbers got shifted around as well. Oh. Hmm. It's supposed to be like TM80 or something. Scald. I think it's like 56, but yeah, it's a high number. It's not fucking two. But yeah, under normal circumstances, it is Dragon Claw. Yeah, I was just thinking, you don't get that that early. Save early, save often, Connor. The fuck was that? That was Seed Bomb, wasn't it? That was fucking Seed Bomb. Probably. Cold storage. Scroopy. And I missed it in the replay. Great. It was Seed Flare. That's right. At level 28, I believe. Yep. I do still have that Max Revive for the <coughs> Lazarus rule, but I think I'm going to save that for like Snuggles or Jeffrey. If I'm being completely honest. Alright. Yeah, that was Seed Flare. This is probably going to hit Metalhead. Never mind, I was like, probably going to hit him like a fucking truck. <sighs> yeah, could you please not clutter up my... Pokemon chat with Fantasy Life, please. It's like people trying to talk about Pokemon when I'm doing Cold Shadow. It's a little annoying, not gonna lie. The fuck was that? I don't know, but it made a pretty terrifyingly loud noise. It was an electric type attack, I can tell you that. Well, I have no idea what it was. I wasn't paying attention. And I'm so far behind that... I think I missed it entirely, too. Jeez. I started dabbing around. Woodhammer! I feel like I've answered this question before, but I'll answer it again. I don't have a, f a single favorite Pokemon. It kind of shifts based on what I'm using. Quagsire's up there for me. Fucking unaware. Shit's scary. <laughs> Though the fact that Quagsire with unaware just became so freaking predictable... He dropped all the way from OU to NU the last time I was playing on Showdown. I still use him in OU because apparently people are not expecting him anymore. Yeah, that, that'll happen. the simple fact that I want to switch back to box one. <clears throat> it was about to dump your new catches into box eight, wasn't it? Hmm? 
<laughs> that it was no, about to dump your new cash into. No, I just uh, told her I wanted to deposit Hellhound and then switch back to box one. Yeah. It's actually a bit of a pisser because I almost had <clears throat> him up to the right level. I actually had a good set on him, somewhat. But what can you do? Yeah, good question. I got nothing, guys. Nurse Webster? Guys, you do know that there's a private message system, you know? You could use that, please. In fact, that's fairly new on this site, isn't it? But I don't know. It's IRC. Oh, yeah, good point. What? Hippopotus Sandstream, zero out of ten. Negative three out of ten. Like it, we're we're going as awful as possible. Great. Are you not at home that you can be on your laptop? Up. Cobble pot. God damn it. Though All I think it's zombies. I think it's fair at this point that I've had a wide enough variety that I would just see zombies anyway. Good point. Yeah, that critical hit wasn't necessary. Good seed bomb still at a fifth attack. Yep, that's okay. <laughs> Fewer times you have to watch the same animation. Not seed better, bomb, right? bullet seed. You know what I mean. Which is probably why you didn't bother correcting me. <laughs> yeah. Uh, well, I know Dwebble's got fucking cotton guard, so I'm just gonna go straight for the fucking fiery dance. Go for the neutral stab, you know. Yep. And I proc the boost. Nice. <clears throat> but probably completely unnecessary. I'm gonna techno blast Curlia. Plus one power one twenty. Yeah. Though technically after stab isn't fiery dance the same thing? Yeah. Ooh, an ass pear berry. <laughs> I don't care if I'm saying that wrong. Swearing just reminds us of how you feel. How much this game is messing with you. Mm hmm. Tristian with Psyduck. That's cute. You think you could beat me with a water type? Mold Breaker <laughs> Psyduck. You say, especially one like Psyduck. Well, remember what happened with Golduck last time. Actually, I'd rather not. <laughs> Dino! What can I possibly hit this thing with? Technoblast. It's the only thing I can hit it neutrally with. Because doesn't gra Dragon uh, resist grass? Yeah. Dragon's a good defensive type. 
That's a shit offensive type, though. Yeah, it's good, yeah. good neutral coverage, but, uh, who cares? The only thing it hits super effectively is itself. Yep. I mean, at least Ghost has, you know, two things that it's super effective on. Yeah. And now it's no longer resisted by steel! Mm-hmm. Hey, a star piece. Some decent Actually, I think money. only one type resists Ghost anyway. And normal's immune to it, but yeah. Uh, yeah, that one type is dark, which is basically the same fucking type. Offensively, yeah. Uh, depends on the situation, really. I don't do a whole lot of doubles, so I'm probably the worst person to ask for double strategies. Though, I do tend to like, um, having an own tempo ally and something else with swagger. You know, use swagger on your, uh, own tempo user. And then have them use swords dance on the same turn. And then just rack asses. <laughs> nice. And then there's the obvious combo of, you know, flying or levitate with Earthquake. And I'm even worse to ask about fucking triples, because triples are just a little too mind-breaking for me. Triples are just what? Pretty much. Another critical hit that didn't matter. Oh, I'm so close to ding in 29. So close that I'm gonna put Eclipse in the front. And then I'm just gonna use a wild Pokemon. Alright. Lazy Stacy. With another fucking Larvesta. Jeez, that's three this session already. Mm-hmm. And it's a shame I don't have a rock type attack. Yeah. Charge beam is the only thing I can hit this thing with. Ooh, it's got muddy water. Oh, that's gross. Yeah. And Water Pulse. Yeesh. Be ye fire or be ye water. It be the type that wants to completely screw you over. It's actually kind of funny it was using water type attacks because it killed it with electricity. <laughs> <laughs> Wasn't super effective, but... You know, concept still stands. Yep. Daniel with Giraffe Rig. Sticky hold to my stench. Yeah, sticky hold would have done you a lot more good there, Giraffe Rig. Let's go for Vacuum Wave. Never mind, I'm gonna use Magnet Bomb. Cause Magnet Bomb can't miss. I completely forgot that you had that. Well, this is the first time I'm actually using Eclipse in battle. Good point. I guess it didn't show that off when you captured it, did it? Nope. And now the audience is dwindled. Part for the course, I suppose. Yep. 
You're not getting completely shafted yet, so... Of course, I'm relatively calm. Yep. Once the salt flows, they'll be back. Oh, yeah. There's, like, no one here. That's why I said that they're trapped. Croconaw! Thanks for the, uh, you know, actual need to use charge beam. Destiny Bond! Yep. Yeah, I know this thing's got... <laughs> what?! What was the point of that?! Destiny Bond switch! It's like Cotton Guard switch earlier, why?! What are you doing, stupid?! Shellos Motor Drive. <laughs> the, ga the game knows that it doesn't have anything that can kill you that badly right now, so instead it's Don't going to get say that. In other ways. Yeah, okay, you're right. Because there's like a lot of the universe that says as soon as something gets said, it immediately gets jinxed. Especially with this. Come on, man. You've been around the Let's Play Circle for how long? A while. I don't remember. Too fucking long. Yep. Actually, I guess I can go look and see when the... Because I have a rough idea of when I first followed any LPers on YouTube. 2008 for me. Raokoun, Doc Sigma, and Tatsudoshi. It was definitely way later than that for me, but... I want to say 2011 was probably when I first followed anyone. Damn. Um... Probably Bryceoff, right? It was around the wheel and then Bryceoff like a month oh, okay. later. Yeah, mid-2011. Because hmm. I found him because of Lemmings and then... Bryceolf just because, you know... Association. They're that close, and then it's bound to happen. Yeah. Yeah. So, like, I actually heard about Round the Wheel I a couple years ago through, uh, Rocco. Because he mentioned it Yeah, because I remember... Yeah. And I... I know basically when I started following both of them, and I'm pretty sure it was the day they posted the second video each of an LP. Yeah. It's really weird. <laughs> it was Oh No More Lemmings for Round the Wheel and the Final Fantasy mod for Bryceolf. Uh, Final Fantasy Hard Type? Yeah. I could have swore that was like 2012, 2013. It, it may have been 2012, but... 